The Shenyang FC-31 was born out of China's desire to develop an indigenous stealth fighter that could rival the F-35 and maintain pace with other global military powers. As the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAAF, sought to modernize its fleet, the FC-31 was envisioned as a versatile multi-role fighter that could bolster China's defense and potentially become an export success. Developed by Shenyang Aircraft Corporation, the FC-31 was an ambitious project that began in the late 2000s. Drawing on lessons learned from the J-20 stealth fighter program, engineers aimed to create a smaller, more versatile aircraft. The design phase included significant research into radar-absorbing materials, advanced avionics, and propulsion systems, all critical components for a stealth fighter. The FC-31 took to the skies for the first time on October 31, 2012. This maiden flight marked a significant milestone for the project, showcasing the aircraft's design and capabilities. Over the next several years, the FC-31 underwent extensive testing, including high-speed maneuvers, weapons integration, and stealth effectiveness. Each test provided valuable data to refine the aircraft further. The FC-31 stands at approximately 16.9 meters in length, with a wingspan of 11.5 meters and a height of 4.8 meters. With an empty weight of around 17,500 kilograms, this aircraft was designed for agility and speed. It can reach a maximum speed of Mach 1.8 and has an estimated combat range of 1,250 kilometers. Armed with a variety of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles, along with internal weapons bays to maintain stealth, the FC-31 was intended to be a formidable adversary in the skies. One of the key advantages of the FC-31 is its stealth design, which incorporates radar-absorbing materials and internal weapon bays. This makes it difficult for enemy radar systems to detect the aircraft. Additionally, its twin-engine configuration provides redundancy and improved performance in various combat scenarios. The FC-31 also boasts advanced avionics and sensor systems, giving pilots enhanced situational awareness and targeting capabilities. One of the unique aspects of the FC-31 is its potential role as a carrier-based fighter for China's emerging naval aviation capabilities. While the J-15 currently serves as the backbone of the PLA Navy's carrier air wings, the FC-31's smaller size and advanced technology made it a strong candidate for future naval operations. However, this role remains speculative. Despite its potential, the FC-31 has not entered mass production. Several factors contributed to this outcome including the prioritization of the J-20 program, which serves a similar strategic purpose. Additionally, concerns about the FC-31's cost-effectiveness, as well as competition from other Chinese defense projects, may have played a role in this decision. While the FC-31 was designed with stealth and versatility in mind, it also faced significant challenges. The aircraft's engines, derived from older Russian designs, struggled to meet performance expectations, particularly in terms of thrust and fuel efficiency. Additionally, the FC-31 stealth features, while advanced, were not as effective as those on more mature platforms like the F-22 or F-35. These issues, combined with the high costs of development, limited the aircraft's appeal both domestically and internationally. To address these shortcomings, Chinese engineers have continued to refine their stealth and propulsion technologies. The lessons learned from the FC-31 program have informed subsequent projects, leading to improvements in aircraft design and capabilities. However, these solutions have yet to be fully realized in the form of a mass-produced FC-31. To date, only a handful of FC-31 prototypes have been produced, with estimates ranging from two to five units. These aircraft continue to serve as test beds for new technologies and may influence future Chinese fighter designs. The Shenyang FC-31 remains a fascinating chapter in the history of Chinese aviation, a stealth fighter that, despite its potential, never fully took flight in the way its creators envisioned. As China continues to advance its military capabilities, the FC-31 serves as a reminder of the challenges and complexities involved in developing next-generation air power. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more looks at the world's most intriguing military aircraft.